Welcome back to River City Live. Patty Jacks from Visit Jacksonville is still here with us, and she brought along her friend who I think I could call you a friend too. We bonded. This is my man Jason Tetlack, who is plugged into all things Murray Hill, but you guys have you're expanding it even more. They have a great event coming up. Jason is an artist here who has got a reputation that is growing exponentially. So tell us about this event that you guys have going on. Do I well, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, I've decided that I wanted to do something a little different. You know, that's, that's kind of my uh, go-to. And so I approached Visit Jax about doing something a little unique. And we're going to turn the city of Jacksonville into a gallery. Okay. And we're going to put paintings all over town. Really? I mean, but we've got murals. I've seen your murals. And I mean, you're, if you haven't been over to Brooklyn, you've got to check out that BC Boys 3D mural. But all right, so we've got murals. What kind of art are we talking about? Well, I've put together a painting that um, I've painted onto 20 smaller canvases. Here's a couple of them here. And we're going to hide these paintings all over town, and people can go out and find them, and it's theirs to keep. So this is a different version from that uh, wizarding thing that everybody's doing. With. <laughs> you actually get some tangibility with this. That's yes. awesome. Now, what's it like for Visit Jacksonville to have partnered up on an event like this? I mean, we're super honored. When Jason came in and he had this idea, he said, how about we turn the city into an art gallery? We were like, you want to partner with us? <laughs> um, but it's fantastic. It's an opportunity to make people go out of, you know, out of their house, out of their comfort zone, and go check out other places in the city. I mean, we're going to hide these pieces in parks, in businesses, and common areas where people can go and discover something new about Jacksonville, discover art in those areas, and then discover this piece of art. And we're calling it Jack's Art Hunt. Nice. And so for the next 11 days, kicking off tomorrow, we will hide several pieces a day. We will give a clues in our um, Instagram page, so at Visit Jack's on Instagram. And then you can go find where they are. And then the best part of it is that once you find it, you get to keep it. So you own a piece of original art by Jason. And then, um, you know, on the back of each piece, it tells you what else to do. It's pretty cool. You go online. And when it's all done, when all pieces are collected, it's going to reveal a very special message. Oh, no way. Yes. Yeah. So, I mean, there's the incentive for people to go out and venture throughout the city and find these pieces. Yeah. See, I was th and I was going to suggest, like, make sure you, like, take a picture or something so people know that the art has been picked up. But now you guys are like, if you pick it up, you really want to be plugged in <laughs> to what's going on. That's like, so you, why are you so uh, trying to make sure that art is shared with so many in the community? I think a lot of people, their experience with art is at MoCA or Comer, and it's very, like, museum-style, quiet space. And art is a lot more than that. We have such a good pool of artists in Jacksonville, and it's just a way for people to get more in tune with the art that's happening. And, you know, there's so many artists over at Cork that are doing crazy things, and, and people just don't know about it. So this is a way to kind of get art into other places where people can see it happen. And with this whole art search and then Instagram and the connection with you, this is just another way for the community to connect on a larger scale. And is there a hashtag, you know, people, so maybe they don't find an art, but they're out searching, but they want to let people know, is there a hashtag like, hey, I am out putting in work? Yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> so um, we wanted people to use the hashtag Jack's Art Hunt and also only in Jack's. And then be sure to follow us, uh, visit underscore Jack's on Instagram, and that's where all the clues will be. When you find a picture, when you find one of the art pieces, take a picture, tag yourself, use the hashtag. That way we know where it is. And then um, be on the lookout, you know? I can't wait to see what the finished piece looks like. And I can already see, okay, it's a puzzle. I like it. I like it. Good man. Gosh, you were a genius. All right, so thank you guys for joining us. Good luck on the hunt out there. So make sure you hashtag Jack's Art Hunt. And, uh, yeah, we want to see what the whole thing's about. So, uh, Eden, let's see what you have going on over there.